We continue to bring you the latest and important developments on the front lines of the Ukraine-Russia war. The Ukrainian army has achieved significant successes on many fronts in the last 24 hours. The General Staff of the Armed Forces of Ukraine shared the latest developments on the front line in its report. According to the report, the Ukrainian armed forces continue their counterattack on the Melitopol and Bakhmut fronts without slowing down. The Ukrainian army has achieved significant success, making partial advances and consolidating positions in the areas west of Robotina and near Klechivka and Andrivka. On the Bakhmut front, one of the most critical fronts of the war, the Russian army attacked the Ukrainian forces in the Andrivka area in an attempt to recapture the positions it had lost earlier. However, Ukraine's defenses in the area were strong and they successfully repelled the Russian troops. The Ukrainian army continues offensive operations in the area south of Bakhmut, Donetsk Oblast, inflicting losses in manpower and equipment on the Russians and consolidating their positions. The Avdivka Front, in the area of responsibility of the Tavria Operational Strategic Group, was also very active. Ukrainian forces defeated Russian troops in the Pervomaisk area of Donetsk Oblast. In addition, the Russian army launched more than 10 unsuccessful attacks in the Marinka and Krasnohorivka regions. The Liman Front was also dominated by Ukraine. More than 10 Russian attacks were successfully repulsed near Makivka in Luhansk Oblast. On the Kherson Front, the Ukrainian army destroyed critical Russian army depots and successfully hit the Russians in the rear. On the Shakhtarsk, Zaporizhia and Kupyansk fronts, the Russian armed forces did not attempt any offensive.